So there are two parts here in the source. Can I give you a little bit of time? Don't look at the answer key, right? What I want you to look out for is the parameter first. Reliable, whether it is a mistake. How do you say yes? Okay, and how do you say no? You take a look at your answer first. Look at your own parameter, your yes parameter content and your no parameter content. Okay, and you think you decide whether you think do you think it's okay? Do you think okay? You can show it to your friends for verification. Show your friends, just swap your answer to your friend and read and, and, and ask your friend. Right? Can you turn to page 14 of your answer key? Okay. Alright. Now this is someone who is doing this is someone who is giving you an answer in three paragraphs, okay? You take a look how the person writes. Source F shows that the West Bank is a mistake. It's a mistake to peaceful Palestinians who are not terrorists. Now, that's very important. You notice that there is a parameter here. The parameter here is that it is a mistake to peaceful Palestinians who are not terrorists. Right? In other words, it was a specific reliability question, but it became even more specific when you have the answer frame out like that. Okay, so it is reliable as a mistake to peaceful Palestinians who are not terrorists. Because of the war, both peaceful and terrorist Palestinians suffer from the checkpoint system, the barriers. These are all the details. Then the evidence is, this shows that all Palestinians suffer together. Alright? Now, there's a restatement there and it is a mistake for those Palestinians who have committed no wrong. Okay? So that, that alone gets you three marks. A very good parameter. Okay? That means you must sort of explain to me, reliable as a mistake, why? And the best, easiest way is to whom is it a mistake? So to peaceful Palestinians, it is a mistake because they suffer. Uh. Okay, this is one way to do it. Another way to do another way to do it, okay, is uh, uh, page 13. Page 13, if you look at level 4, alright. Okay, uh, sorry, you look at level 3, page 13, level 3. Source F shows that the West Bank is a mistake as it has unintended consequence of making life worse for the Palestinians. Now, in fact, the parameter here is this. We look at the definition of mistake. Mistake is anything that has unintended consequences that are negative. Okay? Unintended consequences that are negative. So you need to explain. Uh, unintended consequences to whom? Again, for the Palestinians. So it was a mistake to them. Like so-called like the unintended consequences. Uh, that means when the Palestinians build it, maybe they know or maybe they don't know that this will lead to something like this and it will get worse and worse. That's the explanation. So these two parameters are, are accepted. In other words, let's, learning point is what? Learning point is that right, even though a specific reliability question, in your parameter, you make it even more specific to whom. Okay? That's one way. And secondly, if it's a mistake, think about all the negatives you can associate with mistake unintended consequences, alright, it has certain things that it wasn't aimed to do but it came out as a result and so on and so on. Alright, so there you have it, okay? Now how do you say not reliable? This time you have more things to say. On page 13 also, you see the word all? F shows that West Bank was not a mistake, alright? It was not a mistake to the Palestinians, alright? It was a leadership crisis that made their lives worse. Okay, so that's one parameter. Split up the two sentences. Somewhere below on page 14. Okay. It is uh, it is page 14 right on top. Huh? It is not reliable in telling me that the barrier was a mistake to the Israelis. Not a mistake to the Israelis. It was a good thing for them. He was able to provide them with peace security from suicide bombings. Alright? Okay, so that's one. Uh, right. Okay. So where's the detail one? Where is the detail? 